All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone and the sincere Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. I want to go in on this topic of how um, the current situation that's happening in the Dem Dem Dominican Republic is prophecies according to the scripture. Um, I'm going to read this article, right? Uh, it says five things to know about the cleaning of the of Haitians from the Dominican Republic. Now, I'm going to prove how the Dominican Republicans are um, Israelites and the Haitians are Israelites. Now, if you look at these uh, females right here, you see that they're clearly of dark skin complexion you know now uh i'm gonna go and read the the article it says the dominican republic might deport more than a hundred thousand dominicans of haitian descent to haiti in three days reports the nation if you haven't heard about the social cleanings taking place in the DR, it's because mainstream media aren't covering covering them. Even Human Rights Watch, a nonprofit dedicated to upholding political freedom and preventing discrimination, has no mention of the Dominican Republic on its homepage. Below are five things you need to know about what's happening in the Dominican Republic. The DR government has revoked the citizenship of more than 100,000 Dominicans born in the country of Haitian parents. If the Dominican Republic proceeds with a deportation plan, the Dominican Republic Haitians, I mean the Dominican Haitians will be rendered stateless. According to Dominican Today, DR president Delino Medina delivered a speech in February reminding foreign nations and international bodies that they cannot require the DR to compromise its legal order or constitution in relation to migration or sovereign rights. I'm going to just read the uh, key points. It says, many of the Dominican-born Haitians facing a loom looming threat of deportation have never visited Haiti or know anyone there, right? It says the criteria the government will use in deciding who is to be bussed out of the country is dark-skinned Dominicans with facial features. I mean, I said Haitian features, facial features. It says the DR government claims to have established a legalized pro legalization process for Dominican Haitians wishing to remain in the country, but the system is close to impossible, according to sources on the ground. Even though currently the de deportation of Dominican, I mean Dominic Haitians, persists as only a possibility, all evidence points to it happening. Okay, <clears throat> now we're going to this. Uh, one West, uh, you know, document of uh, proving who the Haitians are to this day and the Dominicans, who they are, you know, their uh, biblical names, you know, because Dominican and Haiti are not in the Bible. Now, the Dominicans would be from the tribe of Simeon and the Haitians would be from the tribe of Levi, right? Now, as you see on this 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 thing, it shows you uh, what uh, Simeon mean, you know, and it's uh, uh, in Genesis 29 and 33, how you can read up on Simeon, but also uh, Levi, you know, same thing. Um, now, with this, right? It says, the tribe of Levi Haitians, along with Judah and Benjamin, were sold into captivity by the Africans and the Arabs to the, to the white man. The white man then transported them 
and chains on slave ships to Haiti to serve hard bondage, right? Now, Genesis 49 and 5, it says, Simeon and Levi are brethren. Instruments of cruelty are in their habitations, right? It says, Simeon and Levi are brethren. All Jacob's sons are brothers. The reason he specifies Simeon and Levi are brethren is because in the last days they would dwell together in one place, the island of Hispaniola, right? Now, let me pull up. The island of Hispaniola. Okay. Just a quick uh, example. You know, on the left you have Haiti. You know, as you see right here, Haiti. And on the right you have the Dominican Republic. Okay. So it says, uh, the island of Hispaniola, instruments of cruelty are in their habitations, right? Meaning they are heavily involved in the use of witchcraft and the worship of Satan. In the past, Levi was renowned for dealing with spiritual forces of the heavenly father, the priesthood. However, the scripture specifies of cruelty, meaning sp spiritual forces of Satan, witchcraft. Their habitations are Haiti and the Dominican Republic. In Haiti, their instruments of cruelty is called voodoo. In the Dominican Republic, the instru their instruments of cruelty is called bruea, bruea. Right? Now, here goes the, the, the key point. It says, Genesis 49 and 6. O my soul, come not thou un into their secret, unto their assembly, Mine honor, be not thou united, for in their anger they slew a man, and in their self-will they dig down a wall. O my soul, meaning Israel, in Genesis 32 and 20, 28, Jacob's name was changed to Israel. Come not thou into their secret, meaning Israel, learn not the secret of their witchcraft. Unto their assembly is their dwelling together, I mean, is the dwelling together of these brothers in one place, Hispaniola. Simeon and Levi are the honor of Jacob, but be thou not united means, my bad, although Simeon and Levi are brethren assembled together, they would not be united. That is why on the island of Hispaniola, there is a division. On one side, you have Haiti. You have the tribe of Levi who speak French. Whereas on the other side, you have on, on the other side of the same island, you have the tribe of Simeon and the Dominican Republic speaking Spanish. For in their anger, they slew a man and in their self-will, they dig down a wall. The man was the man they slew was Shechem, an African prince, you know. But the, the, the main point is it says, be not thou united, you know, even though that they are on the same island. You know, living together, uh, especially from off of this article, you know, they they aren't united even still to this day. You know, and they're kicking them out. They're kicking out the Haitians, you know, and this is all prophecies. This was written way before, you know, they even came together on this island, you know, and I'm going to go to this scripture right here now this is genesis 49 and 1 because this is a prophecy it says and jacob called unto his sons and said gather yourselves together that i may tell you that which shall befall you in the last days so in the last days these got the, the simeon and levi the tribe of simeon and levi were meant to be on this island together you know and dwell on this island together and it's more on the on the article. If you guys wanna uh wanna wanna get the article about the twelve tribes of Israel, you know, feel free to hit me up and I'll uh send it to you guys. But this is all prophecy, you know, with the, the cleaning of the Haitians from the Dominican Republic. They're not trying to be united, you know. So with that I wanna give uh all praises, honor and glory to Yahweh by Sim Yahweh Just uh, double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone and the sincere Salawan to all the Akim out here. Salawan.